Okay, all right, uh, Surbhi, thanks very much for that. Well, with regards to the insurance industry now, several insurance stocks have posted their business updates and have seen a fall in the recent sessions. Uh, Yash is here with the details on this. Uh, well, Ekta, as Surbi pointed out, the stocks certainly are not obliging to the strong data which the life insurance industry has posted. As far as the industry is concerned, the strong data was on expected lines. So the life insurance industry, the private life insurance space, has grown its premium by 35% in the month of March on a year-on-year -year basis. FI23 premium growth, that stands at 20% and March retail annualized premium equivalent, that has grown by 56% for the private life insurance industry. Uh, the star performer here from the private pack has been HDFC Life. The March premium has grown by 83%. The retail AP has grown by 118% on a year-on-year -year basis. Uh, this is followed by a strong performance from Max Life, where the March premium has grown by 43% and the retail AP is seeing a growth of a healthy 60% uh, rate. ICICI Prudential Life, the March premium is up 31%, retail AP uh, grows by 59%. Finally, SPI Life Insurance, the March premium seeing a decent growth of 23% and the retail AP growing by 12%. Uh, the PSU side, uh, which means LIC, was the weak link here. Uh, the March premium for LIC, in fact, contracted by 32%. The retail AP grew just by about 10%, which sort of took the entire industry data down, where the March premium for the total life insurance industry was down 13% in the month of March on a year-on-year -year basis. And FI23 could only grow by about 18%. All right, Yash, thank you so much for joining us with those updates. Uh, with that, we'll take your leave on this edition.